What's up, people? Um, this video is going to be unedited. I'm just going to upload it. I'm going to put a green screen on it, but whatever. And as the title suggests, this is about YouTubers that I hate. I'm not going to be going into specifics, and I really don't hate anyone. It's just like the best term that I could use. Like, I don't... YouTubers I dislike, no. YouTubers that I loathe, no, because I don't loathe any of them either. Just a lot of them get on my nerves. I'm going to be very general, and when I say things, I'm not pointing fingers or saying names. This is just my two cents about the platform that I love so much, and just about some things that people do on here that get on my nerves. Okay, like, the first thing. If you've got a five to ten minute video, you should not have five or six ads in it. There's more ads in your videos than there are on television shows. Network syndicated television shows. That is annoying. Like, when you're in the middle of saying something and it goes, pause, and it cuts to a, uh, an ad, that's really annoying. As a watcher, it gets old. And that is something that will turn me off on you so fast. Like, ugh, that is like at the top of the top of the top of my list of things that people do on YouTube that get on my nerves. The second thing is people that you think you're friends with or are friends with, I don't, I don't know. They, they play like devil's advocate with people. Like they'll say one thing to you and then say something else to somebody else. I don't see, see. Oh, CC Suarez just tweeted, if you guys do not know who she is, you guys need to go check her out. She does bomb ass makeup. She's been awesome to me. I love her so much. Uh, but yeah, back to that, like, people that are fake, like, and when I say fake, I mean like fake. Like, they'll smile to your face, but you know they're talking shit about you behind your back. Like, that's so, that's so, like high school like and all the all the youtubers that i interact with are 18 and above so it's juvenile like if i'm friends with you that doesn't mean that you can't be friends with someone else but the people that i know i know that they probably set up and talk shit about me and that's fine. And this is like, guys, don't assume because this is probably not who you even, you guys might not even know who I'm talking about. Matter of fact, I know that you probably don't know who I talk about because this is not like a really public relationship that I have with this person on YouTube. Although we're actually friends, comment sections will tell you the world. That is another thing, like comment sections. Like, you can see people literally backstabbing you in comment sections. That's so annoying. Like, you know I can see you commenting on this video, right? Like, you know that. <laughs> that would be like me talking shit about CC in my comment section. Like, what? Like, I, I don't know. I guess people think that if you're a YouTuber, you don't watch YouTube videos, but like, I watch YouTube videos. I don't watch TV. I'm not a TV watcher. I don't watch Netflix. I, I have Netflix. I have Amazon Prime. I don't watch Prime. I watch YouTube for the, for all of my content. Like, like the content that I consume comes from YouTube. That's why people like, and that's another thing. Like I can't stand how people get mad when you're a fan of someone. Like if you're an Uber fan of someone, so what? It's a what? It's a big deal that I'm like an uber fan of like all these people that I tweet every single day. No. That's my business. Is it affecting you in any way, shape, or form that I'm tweeting Manny MUA or Jeffree Star or Trisha Paytas or anyone? If you don't like who I tweet, don't follow me on Twitter. And if you don't like what I post on YouTube, don't watch my videos. It's not like I'm begging you. I'm here for interaction. Like I said, I am like an uber YouTube fan. Like, I've been watching YouTube since the start. Like, from the beginning of YouTube. I think the subscribe button was yellow when I started watching. I can't remember. But, the people that I watch, I've watched for a very long time. So, if I want to be active with them on social media, so what? 
that's another thing. The shade. Like, shade is cute, shade is fun, shade is fine, but when you do it in every single video about Tom, Dick, or Harry that you're making the video about, and you're shading someone else, grow up. Like, especially if you're like 40 plus years old, 45 to 50 years old, grow up. Like, there are some YouTubers that just dedicate their whole channel to slamming other YouTubers. Expose this. Oh, I'm gonna tell that. Like, no. I'm over that. Like, and a lot of people, luckily, I have got out of my recommended videos because I've hit not interested so many times. They're gone. I just don't understand why... YouTube, like, YouTube as a community, like, YouTube used to be a community, and that is what I still try, like, people will trip out when I respond to their comments or respond to their tweets. I don't know why, I'm just a guy sitting behind a camera, I don't even have that big of a following here, I may not ever, but I'm very appreciative to the people that actually watch my content, I mean, it's cool. Like, if I take time out of my day to make a video, it's awesome that somebody takes time out of their day to watch it. If it's 50 people or if it's 100 people. It's cool. Thank you. There's just a lot of people that, I don't want to say entitled, but they feel like, well, I feel like, they just have their nose up to people. Like, at the end of the day, it doesn't matter if you're a movie star, a singer, a YouTuber, we're all the same. Some have a little bit more money than others. Others don't, but money doesn't make you. It's your content of your character that makes you. We're all the same. And people are just so catty. God. Some of the people that I've dealt with are so, so catty. And they act like they're so uppity and so much better than other people. Like, no, that's not a good look. You people need to humble yourselves. I know that you probably all seen or heard or interacted with some kind of youtuber that's been that way that's gross um but then again on the other side of that there's a lot of youtubers that are actually very humble and very 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 nice like big youtubers and that's actually what's fun about youtube i've just like went on a tangent and i don't know like today has just been like a really weird day for me and i got kind of triggered when I was in the comment section of a video and I was like, you know what? This person really, really gets on my nerves. But that person shall remember. <laughs> that person shall remain nameless because I don't want drama. And yeah, I don't know. What's your guys' thoughts on this? Like, have you ever interacted with a YouTuber that's catty? Have you ever dealt with someone on YouTube that you see them doing one thing and saying another in a comment section of another video. Do you guys ever see that? And this video is not by any means meant to like stir any kind of pot or anything. This is just me thinking out loud, speaking what I had going through my mind. I'm not being rude, negative, nasty, or mean because to each their own. Like I don't want drama with anybody that's like not my cup of tea. I comment on things that interest me and that's really about it. If I've made a video about it, it's because it's something that interests me. Um, all of my videos are not drama videos. I try to diversify what my channel is because it's a variety channel. But some of the videos that I've actually seen today, I was like, wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and then the go back and the, the back and forth on Twitter, I was like, damn. And <laughs> this person probably doesn't watch my videos. But she knows I love her. And she was giving me life. And I was like, damn, you caught him out. I like videos that people are interested in. I Like, you can tell when somebody makes a video that they're interested in. In the way that they talk. Or if they're just making a video for views and notoriety and things like that. I'm not here for notoriety. I'm here for community. I'm here for interaction. I'm here for getting to know you guys. And I hope you guys know that. Anybody that has ever, like message me on Twitter. I always try to respond. If you snap me, I definitely try to respond. Although I am very, very slow with responding to messages on Snapchat. <laughs> but 
if you've ever interacted with me and I haven't got back to you, which is probably few and far between because I try to comment back and I've comment I was actually commenting back to people at work today while I had some free time. I want you to know message me again or something and I will definitely try, but there shouldn't be that many of you. Um my channel is an open place for discussion and that's pretty much what this channel is. You might get a video review of like a face cleanser or a camera or a ring light or a rant. You just never know what you're going to get with me. And that's what I like, the variety. Like I can talk to you guys about anything that I want. And a lot of you guys share a lot of the same opinions as I do and I find that very, very cool because I don't really like, aside from Eric, um, I don't really have friends. Like, I have people that I associate with at work and talk to, and I consider them my friends, but outside of work, it's just non-existent. And it's cool that you guys sit here and actually watch me. There's actually a video that I want to do that has been a really hot topic here on YouTube lately, but I don't know if you guys would be interested in it. Um, and I don't want to give away my idea because I don't think anybody's done it. Um, but it is a conspiracy video, and I used to be very deeply embedded into the conspiracy stuff here on YouTube before I started my channel. I would watch conspiracy videos, and I'm not talking about, like, channels like mine that do conspiracy videos. I'm talking about, like, coast-to-coast -coast radio and stuff like that. Um, that stuff is really interesting to me, and if you guys would be interested in that type of thing, I would love to do that because, like I said, I'm not in this for monetary gain. I never have been. I'm self-funded. I work. Um, so if you guys would like that, share your opinions on what you would like me to do my video on, and if you've made it this far, you're the reason I'm here, uh, leave me a green heart or some kind of emoji in my comment section. But, I really hope I didn't, like, get on your nerves with this video or anything like that. This is kind of like, kind of like a diary entry, almost. I'm just doing it on camera. Hmm. But anyway, you guys, thanks for listening to me ramble. Uh, if you're new here, my name's Dustin. Uh, you can subscribe to my channel if you'd like. I would really appreciate it. That would be amazing. It would really probably make my day. But that's okay if you don't. You can leave me a like or a dislike. That is your opinion. You can do so as you choose here on this channel because we're all entitled to our opinion here on this channel, be it if I don't agree with you or not. It's not my place to agree with you or disagree with you. Uh, I can just state my opinions and you can state yours. But I hope you guys have a great night. Tomorrow is Friday. Thank you, Jesus. And I will see you on my next video.